I'd like to welcome everyone to the Aquaware 4.0 Quantum Layering Session video tutorial. In this video we'll be going over one of the advanced features called Quantum Layering Session or QLS for short. Um, what this feature allows you to do is put up to seven intents into the target water. Um, prior versions of Aquaware only allowed you to do one intent. So we wrote a new algorithm which now layers each intent inside the water. This is really uh, groundbreaking and mind-blowing. So without further ado, I'm going to show you how it works. So we clicked on the Advanced Features tab and I'm going to set my mode to Standard which runs Water Prep, User Prep, and then your intent. So the, the first step we have to accomplish is, is building our first intent. Okay, so I'm going to come back here to intent type 7, and I'm going to, I'm sorry, 6, and we're going to use the vitamins for this one. So I will set my power level. Uh, I generally use 81%. That's just a, just a good number for me. And from the drop-down menu, we're going to select vitamins. I think we're going to use vitamin K for this one. So again, where your attention goes, the intention goes. So, and we're just building a QLS, or I'm sorry, an ALS file at this point. So we click here, we are in manual mode. So you're gonna notice water prep runs first. Again, each of the water prep and user prep run for 22 seconds. Okay, so effectively, since we're really just building um, the ALS files for the QLS. ALS stands for Aquaware Layering Session. The QLS stands for Quantum Layering Session. Um, we really don't need to put your attention anywhere because we're just we're building that that file that will contain seven and tens for us. Or if you want to just you know put your attention on the water and do it anyways, that's fine as well. So again, we're running water prep, user prep, intent inside of standard mode, which is really the easiest mode for beginners to use in the aquaware genre. Now you'll notice that vitamin K is nucleating. Each intent runs for a total of 44 seconds. Again, I run my power level at 81. It's just a good number for me. I've been using that a long time. I get the results that I want. Um, sometimes I will go into um, manual mode and crank it up a little bit, but generally not. The Aquaware 4.0 manual has some really good examples of um, all the advanced features. Okay, so we're coming to an end here. So the first thing you're going to notice is you're going to get a save button which we're going to say yes and we're going to call this particular intent vitamin K. Okay. Now you notice I've already created seven other ones here um, just for quickness in the demonstration. Um, vitamin K, it'll give it the extension ALS Aquaware Layering Session. Come down here and click the save button and that intent is automatically saved. Now we're going to come back to our Advanced Features tab and we're going to build a QLS file which is a combination of up to seven ALS files. Now this is really cool. So we come up here and we click it and it brings us to the screen where we saved our ALS's and what you want to do is you'll highlight the first one and then you hold the control key down to put all the others and you'll notice that they're being arranged down at the bottom in order. Now, what will happen is, I, I already had seven in there, and I just want to show you what happens if you try to select eight and hit open. It'll give you a quick message that says maximum seven files are allowed to merge into a QLS file. Selected files are eight. Please try again. So we say, okay, we're going to come back, and we're going to select only seven of them. Okay, now we've selected seven ALS files. We'll come back to open. And now what it's going to do is it's going to ask us to save it as a QLS file. So in essence, it's taking the seven files, it's putting them together in one file, and we're going to run them all in a minute. So from here, we're going to call this um, Morning Vitamins. We're going to click on the Save button, and it's just saved the QLS. So now we're ready to run it. Again, 
where you put your attention the intention goes so we come back to run and it's going to ask us which one do we want to run this is the morning vitamins we just did now when you click the open button um, it's going to start up water prep user prep and then it's going to run all 70 of the intentions that we just put in there with and it, it has saved the um, power level for each i'm only going to run one or two just for time constraints so we say open and then you put your attention on the target water okay water prep is nucleating again water prep and user prep run for a total of 22 seconds each user preparation is running now again water prep clears the memories and the energies from the water user prep preps the water so when you drink it the subconscious mind it opens up the subconscious mind for acceptance makes it much easier we just put that in there automatically okay now we're running our first vitamin which is vitamin A and these will be run in alphabetical order Again, each one runs for a total of 44 seconds. What we'll do is when it when it runs into the next one, we're gonna uh, we're gonna end this session because you kind of get the point. Now again, on these sessions, water prep, user prep run one time, and then it runs all the intents simultaneously. Okay, we're now running vitamin B complex. I'd like to thank you for watching the Aquaware 4.0 QLS or quantum layering session video tutorial.